Hi, I'm Dr. Bridget Behe. Welcome to Flowers in the Classroom. Today we're going to learn about the parts of a flower. You might start this lesson by reading the very colorful book, Painting a Rainbow. This will give the students an idea of the different sizes, shapes, and colors of flowers as long as well as introducing them to some flower names. The next thing that you're going to want to do is to get a diagram of the flower and go through four main flower parts. You might talk about the leaves and their importance in producing food for flowers. You might talk about the stem and its important role in holding the flower upright. You might talk about the sepals or the dark green petals that hold the colorful petals together. And you also might talk about the beautiful different varieties of flower colors and the, the petals that attract the pollinators. If you can go outside, a good exercise to do would be to take the students out with pen and paper and have them draw some different flowers. They can look at different shapes and sizes and discover the beautiful world of flowers. If you can't go outdoors, you might look online or look through books and have the students also draw pictures of flowers. They can understand then how the leaves, the stem, and the flower grow in relation to each other. For this and other lessons, visit flowersintheclassroom.com.